Hi guys, how are you doing? Um, welcome. I know it's late, but I thought I'd still do my live. Um, I went out and had dinner with my son, and then by the time I got home, gathered what I needed for the live. Um, I was just running a little bit late. Um, so join me as you come in. Say hello. Let me know you are there. Also, um, if you are watching this on the replay at the bottom, please type in re uh, replay so that I know that you watched it. Um, okay, and you're not even seeing me. I thought you were seeing me, but you weren't. <laughs> so let me get this out of the way. And okay, now you can see the whole thing. Um, I am going to do this strawberry jam recipe um, on this board. And oh my gosh, I got to clean the board. Hold on, let me get some water. And then I need one of our magic erasers. Let me spray this with water so that you can see how easy it is to change out designs. So how are you doing tonight, guys? Let me get, um, let me get up. A magic eraser. There it is. These are our magic erasers, guys. They are awesome to come to a pack. And they are pretty nifty and they work better than the magic markers. And I hope I'm live because I'm just I'm getting a message. Okay. Huh. I hope I'm live. Can you please tell me if I'm live? All right, so this is all you have to do to wash your board to change out the design, guys. Look how easy it is. I don't really have to put much effort into this, and voila. So now I'm just gonna get a paper towel, you see? Now I'm just gonna get a paper towel and finish wiping it off. And it's that easy to switch designs. Isn't that nifty? How easily you can switch out the designs just when you get tired of it, you're like, I want a new design. Okay, just clean off your board and done. That's how easy it is. All right, let me get my fuzzing cloth. This is a Chalk Couture fuzzing cloth. I love it. Let me get my transfer out. And guys, I actually want to try this recipe. I want to see if it actually works. I've never done jam, but you know, there's always a first time, right? <laughs> All right, so we want to fuzz, fuzz, fuzz. And so we gotta fuzz it. Remember that you are fuzzing to protect your transfer and also to protect your surface. If the um, transfer is not fuzzed, you can um, possibly remove the, the back, the green of your transfer, or it can get stuck on your surface. And sometimes it'll come off and sometimes it won't, but why do you want to chance it, right? So now let me do this side. So you always want to make sure that you are fuzzing, especially when you are working with um, with uh, wood, glass, uh, uh, tin, the uh, stainless steel cups, all that good jazz. You need to make sure that you properly fuzz your transfer. You don't want to ruin it. You don't want to ruin your surface. All right, this is good. So I'm just gonna place this on here now. I'm gonna try my best to align. And 
I think that's going to be good. And I want to sure, make sure that it is, I don't think this is aligned very well. I think it's more of the edges over here, guys. Let's see. Does that look straight to you guys? Let me see. I think that, to me, that looks straight. I hope it looks straight. What do you think, guys? All right. So, it's the recipe to a strawberry jam. All right. So, here we go. This is going to be super easy. You're probably looking at it saying that's not easy. But you watch. It's easy. So, my strawberries, I'm going to do them in... Um, well, I was going to do raspberry because my red is too red, guys. I think it's too red. You know what? I'll do them in poppy. Okay, I'll do them in poppy. And I've got a lemon down here. So I have my yellow. And this is ink. Can't use ink. Be very careful, guys. Okay, here's my yellow. So let's open these jars up. These are our paste. Be very careful not to confuse them for inks um, because I have confused them myself before. Um, it's very, ooh, I never threw the lid out. Um, it's very easy to confuse. I have done it before and I have done it several times. Um, the way you can tell them apart if you're in a hurry, and this is how I usually catch it, is that, um, the inks, they come with a yellow lid, and the paste, they come with a black lid. But sometimes when you're grabbing them really fast, you may, like I did earlier, I, I grab the, the ink instead of the paste. So just be very careful um, with that. Alrighty, here we go, guys. This is gonna be fast, I promise you. All right, we're gonna do the yellow. And this guy is going to be right here, okay? And then I'm doing the uh, strawberry. In these colors. Now this seems to be a little dry. So I'm just going to put a little bit of water. And move it around okay and this is my straw my uh, strawberries I am putting it a little thicker um, because it's take gonna take me a little bit to get the uh, whole other board done and then right here okay and like I said, I'm just putting it a little bit thicker because I don't want it to dry right away. Oops. All right. So are we ready? We're going to do the white. And this is how easy it's going to be, guys. Here we go. I actually don't like this. I'm gonna use my bigger, um, my bigger uh, squeegee. This guy right here. Just be very careful not to get it in the sections where you don't want it. Okay, so I know that it, it can go really fast. But you gotta remember, 
You don't want it everywhere. So make sure that you're only getting it in the sections that you want, okay? So right here, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring this down. And I'm sorry, I just seem to be concentrating here, guys. <laughs> kind of funny right now it's like I can talk and do this at the same time I swear I just want to make sure that um, I get it only in the areas where I need it okay so I'm just trying to be careful and pick up the excess, but I don't want to get it and mixed in with the other colors, okay? Okay, I'm just gonna go back and pick it up, and then I gotta lift this up, guys, because I need to, this can't dry on my board, okay? I have to pick it up um off of this board because if it dries on here then when i pick up the uh transfer it's just gonna lift everything up with it okay now uh might that happen yes you never know um just to be honest with you sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't but it um you just want to try your best to work fast and pick up that um, that paste, okay? You don't want it to dry on your transfer, and you don't want the transfer to dry on the board. Okay? Oops. All right. So we're going to lift it up slowly yay all right let me put this on here let me get a towel so that I can clean my hands, guys. I don't want to touch everything and get my paste everywhere. But isn't that awesome? Check it out. It is simple, guys. I'm telling you, it is so simple. And it's cute. You can have this in your kitchen. You can give it away as a gift maybe um, a housewarming gift. Um, if you're gonna do it as a gift, um, you can spray it with that Krylon uh, spray um, and, and do it as a gift. Let me, um, let me turn this around so that you can see it. Isn't that cute? I really like it. <laughs> So I think I'm just going to hang it up there um, and let it dry. I'm not going to put the hair dryer to it tonight. All right, guys, if you have any questions, um, are the sheets? Yes, they are reusable between 8 to 10, 12 times, depending on how well you care for them. Um, so what I normally do is I, I usually have a tub of water uh, next to me. But um, um, I don't have it with me right now because I was running late. But um, I, as soon as I do a transfer, I use it. I put it in the tub. And if I'm using another transfer, I put it in the tub. As long as they're in water, they won't stick together. Uh, you just don't want it to be in the open air and then it touch with the backing because it will stick to each other. But you can use these. They are reusable. Um, I've even heard of them being used like 20 times. I have not used them 20 times, um, but I have heard of it. 
um, but the company will tell you that they are reusable between eight and I think it's either 10 or 12 times. So in between there and just depending on the care. Alrighty. Um, I can also do a, a video on how to clean them and all that. If you like, just leave me a comment below and then I will do a video on how to care for your transfers. All right, guys, if there are no other questions, I will let you go. If uh, you need, want to private message me, let me know. All right, guys, you all have a great night and I will see y'all later. Bye.